office fashions run from $25 down to $12.95. They not only look nice to us, they're a good investment. Uh, how's that again, Pat? Tous les filles allaient faire une école. On leur apprenait à repasser, à nettoyer les maisons pendant trois ans. Hein. Donc c'est une école euh, qui est relativement, qui prend pas mal de temps. And so they were, they were doing everything for me, and, and which is not what I need as a scientist. And so I really had to, uh, to kind of raise my voice and, and show them that I was just as capable and as strong as them. La chose plus important, c'était être une bonne euh, femme au foyer. <laughs> Quand elle me raconte ça, je me dis, euh, ah ouais. <laughs> so, <laughs> voilà, c'était chaud. We need to create more role models of women in science, women in STEM fields, women in higher leadership positions um, that show uh, the path to, to other women and to other young uh, female that might want to go into these fields, for example. I would really recommend universities to make efforts to recruit more female professors to provide young women with more mentors and role models to get inspiration from. Ça me donnait confiance en fait. Je me disais que c'était possible. En même temps, quand tu es étudiant, tu ne te poses pas vraiment la question est-ce que c'est possible ou est-ce que c'est pas possible. Mais voir quelqu'un qui avait accompli quelque chose, c'était quand même encourageant. stands for uh, Women in Science and Engineering and Humanities and it's a foundation that intends to support uh, young female students in their careers. So I heard that the EPFL Wish Foundation was offering a grant uh, to allow students like me at that time to do a master project abroad. So I was very excited by the idea and therefore I applied and got the grant. So therefore I was very happy. I got my bachelor's and master's from EPFL and I am very grateful to have received a travel fund from the WISH Foundation to do my master's project abroad. The WISH Foundation enabled me uh, to um, do my thesis in the, at the Technica University of Munich by financially supporting me. Um, the project could not, could not have been taken place in Lausanne as there was no optoacoustic um, lab in Lausanne at that time. We have um, everything to believe that actually tackling diversity in science um, will make science even better. As a young student, I, I didn't get too much support to progress in my studies. Uh, I was from a poor family, so I had difficulties moving out of the country to do my studies. So I would have appreciated this kind of support, both financial and from mentorship. So I think this will also help the future um, female students that come up, the future generation. So I, I think it's a good thing what we're doing. Non, il faudrait casser ces mœurs. C'est c'est bien en allant voir les jeunes pour parce que c'est la nouvelle génération que on peut le plus changer que parce que les personnes qui sont déjà adultes elles auront du mal à changer de d'avis là-dessus et sensibiliser les jeunes et leur les motiver, motiver les jeunes filles à aller dans la science, à leur montrer que elles ont aussi leur place. Ça peut aider à changer et après ça changera aussi sur les générations suivantes. C'est euh, aussi que ça, mais euh, j'aime bien euh, la, la chimie et euh, des fois, je, comme j'ai un microscope chez moi, j'aime bien regarder les particules et euh, voilà. J'ai déjà entendu des garçons en train de dire qu'ils étaient plus forts que les filles, mais pas forcément. Il y a, il y a plein de gens, ils peuvent. c'est pas une question de genre, ou c'est une question de, de ce qu'on fait dans la vie, c'est pas... Alors, moi je pense que peu importe l'âge, peu importe la taille, euh, n'importe, il faut croire en soi et pas se décourager. Je m'appelle Altea Raya, 
Et je viens de Lugano. My name is Diane Ansermet. I'm from Switzerland. My name is Lamia. I'm 31 years old and I live in Zurich. I'm currently a data analyst in a big tech company. My name is Lea Maya and I am a fourth year PhD student at the University of Chicago doing research on the immune system and cancer. My name is Leticia Vianney. I obtained my bachelor and my master in physics from EPFL. Je m'appelle Inès Borza, je suis en terminale S en SPMAT. My name is Anna von Coubert Moral, I'm professor at EPFL in material science and engineering. So things can things change, and I, I really believe that everybody can change the way they interact with women, and women how they interact with other women and other men as well, um, by just understanding that there is this pre-made idea that women cannot do some things, or it's the the men's job, and it, I think it's it's just a question of time and and communication. Mm -hmm.